The part of the plant that we use is very critical to whether it's going to function as an ingredient in a product. When you think about extracting a plant, we think about like dissolves like. If we're looking for water-soluble compounds, we'll use water. If we're looking for oil-soluble compounds, we'll use something that's more oily. So if you are using coffee, you're using hot water to go through coffee grounds and to extract mostly water-soluble compounds. If you add that one-two punch of steam in hot water, you get a different beverage even if you're using the same beans. That pressure is able to give you that richer flavor of coffee. You can taste the chemistry. Those coffee flavor compounds are chemistry. Now, a lot of times, alcohol is the best extract because a lot of plant compounds will come out of the plant with alcohol. Finally, pressurized CO2 will become a liquid and it really is good at extracting oils from plant materials that we want. So we use that as a really good solvent to get potent extracts. When you unpressurize it, it becomes CO2 gas again. So when I talk about extraction techniques, you really need to use the right part and the right solvent to get exactly what you're looking for so that it's giving us what we need to be functional. That's what we do.